What I'm going to do now is I'm just going to go through this drill, take my swing. You'll notice it had a nice thump sound to it. That's because I'm hitting the sand with the back of the face. My divot entered on that box, exited on that box. So that was good. I'm going to go to the next one. Same thing, a nice thump sound because I'm trying to physically, my mental image is I'm trying to hit the sand with this part of my club, not this part, but the very top back of the toe. That's how you get a nice thump sound to it. Same thing, divot started here, exited there. One more time. Now without even thinking about it, I'm going to step up to the ball. The ball comes out just fine. Simple bunker shot. You can keep going down the line. You don't have to think about it. Get a lot of speed, a lot of spin. The ball comes out fine. So as you practice this box drill, this is going to help you get the ball out of the sand and get you less fixated on the golf ball. Because what you need to be really concerned about is taking out perfect divots as you go down this line. The more consistent your divots get, the more consistent bunker player you're going to become. So work on my box drill, the setup cues I give you. Remember that you need loft, speed, and you need to take out some sands because you need to put a lot of spin on the ball. And your bunker play, you'll never worry about hitting a bunker shot again. It's a very simple shot. Practice my box drill and watch your bunker shots improve dramatically.